This is my friend Mark. I'm confused now. <laughs> uh, <so. laughs> Hello everyone, I'm here with my friend Felix Herngren. We're right here on the edge of Lake Tornitrosk in northern Sweden, 200 kilometers above the Arctic Circle. Mm -hmm. And we're here to talk about climate change and global warming. Yeah, uh, but, wait Mark, uh, don't say it like that. I mean, people will turn off the video. It, well, so, it sounds too serious, it's too important stuff, you know. It's one of the challenges of our time. I know, but if people, if, you, if you're on YouTube and you talk about serious stuff, you get like 300 clicks. But if, if, if you have a cat playing piano, you get a million clicks. That's, or, a, that, that's a commitment that I think we should make. That if they stay with us, you'll put a cat <laughs> on a piano? We, we, we find a cat, we, or some kind of animal. Okay. Yeah, playing some kind of instrument. So you heard it from Felix, that's our commitment. Yeah. We're going to talk about global warming and what's one of the challenges that we face in the modern era. Mm -hmm. And we also make a commitment of... Yeah. Doing something really funny with an animal. There you go. Yeah, so stay tuned. Today Felix and I will go to a glacier here mm -hmm. in Sweden to witness change. So how do we get to the glacier? Well, we have, we're going to take a, a helicopter. A helicopter? Yes. We have promised <laughs> to have some uh, animals doing funny stuff okay. to show in the end of this clip so people don't well. just abort it and turn it off, you know. <laughs> okay. So if you well. find a funny animal or, no. a, or a strange animal, just grab it. Here's the rock. Right. Yeah, right. Okay. Yeah. So this is the place where they took the photograph uh, in like 1910, yeah. 1910, 104 yeah. years ago. Yeah, right. See, see, for example, the snow patches here. Right. Are the one, the three you can see over there. Yes. One, Is two, that it? Three. Yeah. yeah. There's nothing left of it. Yeah. <laughs> no. It must. It must be Incredible. hundreds of tons of ice. Millions. Yeah. Millions of tons of ice. Yes. It's like this much of the glacier. Yeah. Yeah. Has been All cut. this is gone. This is where it stood in 1910. Yeah. That ridge was exposed uh, around 1950. Okay. Yeah. So, so the first part, to, it was not retreating that rapidly in the beginning. This is 1977. Uh, you can see the flat land with the water was exposed to this one, but it's... But that's what it is right now. Yeah. yeah. The acceleration is amazing. Yes, it is. Of the melting. Yeah. yeah. These glaciers are extremely sensitive. Look at the warming that we had uh, in, during the 20th century. Uh, we, this corresponds to about one degree of warming. It does? Just, okay. Yeah, the, the first one. But then now we have something different. Now it, we have got an enhancement in the, in the warming. Okay. So, so, so now it, become, it goes quicker. If you melt off that glacier entirely, that will change the, the sea with one micrometer. So, it has, okay. so it's, it's not a very big number. But, you, but Greenland has... Greenland is different. That thing the is, ice shelf there melts and there's significant increase in sea level, is that correct? Yeah, that's right, correct. What is that amount? Uh, the, the total is about six or seven meters. So this Amazing. is something, something. But, would, but uh, what we expect is that, that is south, southern Greenland may, may melt off. Uh, with the present southern climate, part of the southern part of Greenland, and uh, that will uh, add a couple of meters, two meters or so, to, to sea level. Okay. This is something that, that, that happened before the last ice age, yeah. so we know definitely that this is something that is to expect right. with this warm climate. You know, when you stand here, you really would like to take everybody on Earth to come here and see it for themselves. That's right. I mean, I've seen this on pictures before when you showed me at the embassy and so on, and the end. But it's still, when you get here, it's kind of, I mean, I get goosebumps on right. my arms because it's so strong, the feeling up here of, of the, the, the nature that has been here for millions of years, right. which are now changing into something that could ruin the world. That's it's, right. It's, it gets so very real up here. Mm -hmm. um, but what was extraordinary about today was not just what we witness now, but comparing that to the picture of 50 years ago, yeah. 100 years ago, and mm -hmm. seeing just the scale of change. Yeah. It, uh, yeah, I think, I mean, 
our grandparents they saw they could have seen this even if they weren't but but our grandchildren could maybe instead of see that see an ocean which is seven meters higher than, than right. this and and a devastated world kind of that's right and I it's, think that what we heard today also is not only evidence of this change but also that there are some possibilities to mm -hmm. do something about it and that begs the question for us for our generation and also future generations mm -hmm. what is important to us yeah that's a important question for today and tomorrow yeah and for for the the viewers here yeah exactly and maybe now we also we promised them something we did yeah and um, here it is I think we promised the viewers now a cat or playing something we have to sneak up on it come on I don't know if we have if this yeah, one will be cooperative keep low profile. let's see okay maybe the cat gets scared by the flute I see so now Mark yeah I got the flute. You got Felix. the flute? Oops. Yeah. Oh, ah, ah, oh, oh, oh. You all right? Okay. <laughs> you okay? Yeah. Uh, can, you, can you play the <laughs> Can you play the flute? So here we go. Hit it. <laughs> no luck. Come on. No. Excellent. Now that is what I'm talking about playing the flute. <laughs> 